Welcome to TDT Talk, where we tell you the damn truth. Welcome to the truth, where the truth don't lie. lie, lie. Welcome to TDT Talk, where we tell you the damn Greek mythological truth. Damn it, the truth. <laughs> it's the Greek it's truth for me. And Again, the one thing y'all know, TDT, we're always telling the truth. And for you guys that are watching now or watching in the future, if you've listened to everyone's story, do the research, research and see what calls your spirit. But also know with great power comes great responsibility. And I really feel like being an alpha, being a Q, being a Zeta, being a AK, it's too many of y'all. Being one of y'all is a lot of respect that comes behind that. And that's a lineage. That is a line of power and respect and people that have left a mark. So definitely do your research. Hence is why we wanted to do this show to end out Black History Month. So Sharon, take us to our next question. All right. Question. So all of you have spoken about your orgs and how they positively impact the Black community with the service and all the things that you do. So we're going to skip on to the last question, which is why should a person join your organization? Now, you're going to go first this time. Why should a, a young girl watching this video be an AKA? Well, um, to be part of the first and the finest sorority, um, I think it just speaks volumes. Um, for myself, I'm, I wasn't really all that social. You know, I had my friends, but just putting myself out there, um, you know, to network, like I said, with like-minded individuals. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, Delvante, let's, let's go with you. Uh, Why sure. should a young brother be an alpha? Me, myself, personally, I, there's a lot of things I just love about Alpha for sure. I like, just like, I actually view Alpha as like being a better making a man when it comes to my personal choice and fraternities. Um, of course, like, a professional development, developing your leadership skills for sure, like a big thing that I really was invested into. Of course, the motto, quality over quantity for sure. Come I think those kind of things are Come on, why should a young black girl be a part of your organization? Well, first cousin, let me correct you. It's an honor to be invited to become oh, okay. of Zeta Phi Beta Sorority Incorporated. You don't okay. go tomorrow and say I want to be a Zeta and there's a sign up sheet. Mm -hmm. We only pick the best because we are the best. No shade, no no to you, just a little, you know. I'm just saying. I mean well, I saw a tree, but no shade, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Why should three influential young black boys be a Q? Why should they? Because that picture so, was cute. Come on with it. That picture was, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I I want to get, you know, the misconception out of the way. Um, everybody says Q and they don't really see the Omega Man. Um mm -hmm. A lot of things that are portrayed are, you know, as going to parties, stealing girls, doing freaky stuff, all that. But we're never truly acknowledged for, you know, our business side. There's a lot of business that goes into Omega and it's not just parties and it's not built for everybody. Um, uh, Centennial, <laughs> baby, because she been in here for 100, <laughs> 199 problems, <laughs> but being around for 100 years was not one. Baby, <laughs> why should they be a Centennial member with yes. such distinguished uh, traits as yourself, my dear? 22 member, yes. That part. So the question should be, why shouldn't they want to be? Um, and we are people that lead by example. So what we do in the community, we show young ladies how to be young ladies. We want to make sure that they are continuing to keep themselves wholesome. Um, we also want to make sure that, you know, we, we, we have a high standard. We have, we set our standards very high and we take, just like all other organizations, we take the best and we look for the best. Um, mm. And I'm just saying, you know, for me personally, I had to vet 
my daughter to make sure that this is what she would want it to do instead of just following mommy and Sue. But she didn't really have a choice. But I'm not saying gotcha. that. Gotcha. I'm not saying that, you know, just to be me as a mom. But what I'm saying mm. is we choose the best. We want the best. Um, and we give back Welcome for PDT showing Talk, where we young ladies you. how to be the best. True.